Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm Flylores737 and today in this video we're gonna review another great flight bag. We're talking about the Travelproof Flight Crew 5 multi-purpose tote. Here we go with the bag and uh, it is a very spacious uh, big size bag or actually it has a great capacity, a huge capacity but still as uh, it, its dimension contained in a quite well manner because the dimensions are uh, 11.5 inches high, 15 inches wide from left to right and it is 10 uh, inches deep from the front to the, to the back which are equal to about 29 centimeter in height, uh, about 38 in width and uh, about 25.5 centimeter in, in depth. And this bag is very uh, durable, sturdy material, it's all ballistic nylon and uh, let's see how it is composed and how can it be used in everyday life. I think it's suitable for both pilots and uh, uh, cabin crew and it is very durable and from the previous version, from the previous Fly Crew 4, it has this reinforced area at the back and the bottom, uh, as well exactly right here, four uh, plastic feet. And this is to um, avoid or, or uh, reduce uh, abrasion in case you just uh, hold your bag with the hook. Uh, from from your uh, uh, roller board, uh, it has a padded uh, handle, very comfortable with uh, velcro strap. It comes with, uh, of course, a padded shoulder strap, adjustable in length. It is very uh, durable. Uh, everything is made of uh, of metal. Both uh, the hooks at the at the. Um, at the uh, shoulder strap as well as the D-rings in uh, at the back. They are both of, of, of metal, very durable and uh, high quality. So without further ado, let's open it up and see how it is organized uh, inside. Uh, let's start from the back. At the back we have the sleeve or, or the attachment for the uh, rollerboard handle so you can slide it over your rollerboard. We have uh, a nice deep uh, uh, pocket here at the back that goes all the way down to the bottom. On, on the sides uh, we have uh, one zipper here and we have one pocket that goes almost all the way down. It stops right here, almost all the way down to the bottom of the bag. It is quite uh, capable and, uh, you know, if the main compartment is not too filled up, you have quite a good space here. On the other side, we have instead the open water bottle pocket that can be used even for, for example, high visibility vest. It can be adjusted in size using the zipper and it is very suitable for, as well, um, a high visibility vest, for example. Let's come to the main compartment right now. So this is it. It is uh, sealed by two uh, strong zippers that has um, lockable function. Uh, they can be interlocked with uh, um, uh, with a locker. Inside we have a wet pocket at the back of the main compartment and then two uh, pockets at the front. There is nothing on the sides. No pockets both sides. As you can see, it's a wide main compartment that is able to uh, hold, for example, the Bose A20 headset with a case. 
uh, with accessories and everything else, then you have this wet pocket for uh, toiletries or whatever you want to keep separated from the rest of your bag. The only negative thing I can say about the main compartment is this. Since the zippers are not going all the way to the back, but there is a little part of, uh, of nylon here and there that is not covered by the zippers, whenever you open the main compartment, it doesn't stay open. So you have to like force it open like that and in a little bit of time it tends to come back to the closed position as you can see like that and if you force it even further so if you just turn the back of the bag all the way then you have this unpleasant situation where the uh, main compartment stays open, but the dimension of the main compartment tends to be a little bit smaller, especially if you have things at the back, like in the in the back pocket or in your wet pocket, because the bag turns on on this point here. You see, and and the back of the bags comes inside, goes inside and takes away a little bit of space from the main compartment. So I think this is uh, a little bit of a uh, uh, con for, for, for the design of the bag itself. But otherwise it is definitely, definitely well made. So let's go ahead and see how it is composed coming towards the front. Uh, we have another large compartment here for uh, documents mainly and this also has a padded laptop uh, compartment here with a velcro strap. Then we have two mesh pockets here and another compartment for documentation or uh, medium-sized items here. Then we come all the way to the front and we have the uh, business organizer pocket here. We have uh, another mesh pocket, three pen slots. We have the keyring and uh, another pocket here, which is slightly padded and room quite a lot of room for items all the way to the bottom and then here we have another zipper with a separated pocket for whatever you want to keep separated or needs to be separated from the business organizer. This concludes the uh, review of the Fly Crew 5 multipurpose tote from Travel Pro. I hope uh, you found this video interesting and uh, uh, useful. Please comment below if you have any question about this bag and if uh, you want to see more reviews of flight bags from another brand, for example, just uh, comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, I'm Flylore737, see you in my next video.